Hi, this is Paul from finishyoursong.com and in this video I want to have a look at an issue that can drive you a little bit nuts if you don't know what's going on. And it certainly had me cursing more than a couple of times. It's a problem that arises if you use different connections to your computer and it can result in you losing the click um, when you want to record. It's happened to me because when I'm traveling, I use the inbuilt audio interface on the laptop for the work that I do. When I'm at home in the studio, I use my Line 6 audio interface. And when I record these videos, I use a digital headset, all of which leaves me having to reset the VST connections every time I use a different output uh, from the computer. So. I'll give you an example of what the problem is. I've got a new guitar track here, I've got the pre-roll set up for two bars and I've got the click on. I'm not actually going to record but what I want to do is to show you the issue. So you hit go And as you can see, although I wasn't recording guitar, there was no click. So, where is it? Well, the answer is, you can have a look at the click settings as much as you like. They're actually on the transport menu. And you can go into metronome setup and there's all these things that tell you it work. And you can click away on these to your heart's content if you've got no click it doesn't make a slightest bit of difference. Where it does make a difference is if you go into devices into your VST connections and as you can see on the outputs tab I've got it set up I'm using the ASIO for all driver with the digital headset and there's this little column here which says click. If I click in that the word click appears and as if by magic So does the click. If you've ever lost your click in Cubase and wondered how the blazes you get it back, that's how you do it. And the really irritating thing about this little problem is that you can have five or six projects on the go and only one of them loses the click. So this is a setting that's unique to your project, not to your main settings in Cubase which is one of the things that can lead you to think that it's something to do with the project setup rather than the device setup. But there you go. Hope that helps and until next time, you take care of yourselves.